you're in such great shape, and you, and you are so uh, vibrant, and and you're really funny too. And but when you look down at people, and and you're insulting them usually all the entire time. <laughs> Do you lose faith in humanity? You know, I think that as you get older, you realize that there are very few really important things: your health, family's health, um, the world around you. And when people fight over minutia and ruin their lives, you know, a period of their lives, fighting over whether or not a button came back wrong on the shirt or whether somebody stole your mother's tea service when she was moving from her apartment, and that takes control of your life, I think it's a ridiculous mistake. I also think women make a terrible mistake because they usually are so desperate to nest that they pick on schlubs and worthless pieces of trash that they pick up in a bar okay. <laughs> and then turn around, give them the keys to their car, invite them to move in, give them a credit card, and they're surprised one day when their car is gone, their credit card is maxed, and they're alone. And they seem to replicate that behavior again and again. And so that frustrates me. It yeah. especially frustrates me when uh, women are taken advantage of, which, yeah. as you see, happens more yes. often than not. Yeah, that's why I don't date men. Um, so, <laughs> I mean, that's the whole reason. Just for that. Um, but so I wish that that would seep in, though, because you seem to be, and, and thank goodness, because you have a show 20 years running because of these people making the same mistakes over and over and over again. That's true. But I mean, don't, it, it is frustrating when you see women being taken advantage of, because you would think that, because your show's very popular, it would kind of stop. People would, women wouldn't be so desperate and wouldn't let those schlubs, as you call them, into their lives and start giving them all the stuff. The only way it won't happen is if you equip yourself to be financially independent. Mm -hmm. Because once a woman gives up financial independence to a mate, it's over. Yeah. Because you, there's not an equality anymore. And I know I'm gonna get a lot of mail, I don't care, I don't read negative mail, don't send me negative mail. What I'm telling you is, you don't necessarily have to use, use your craft, use your career, but you have to be prepared because mm -hmm. if you're not prepared, then you're stuck. And more women have to accept lifestyles that are unpleasant because they are financially stuck. So if you're smart, you teach your daughters, teach your granddaughters, everybody has to have something that they're good at where they can earn a living. You know, not everybody's gonna be a millionaire, but you right. gotta learn how to make a living. Whether, whether you work or not, you have to do that, yeah. yeah.